Hi, I'm Laura Pisorno. I'm a bone health expert and the author of the book, Your Bones. I'm so glad you're here to learn more about strontium. Its proper use can greatly help you improve the health of your bones. So let's get started discussing strontium by looking at its three important forms and the side effects of one of them. In its natural form, strontium is a mineral found in the soil. But strontium is also naturally found in your bones, just like calcium. Strontium is a bone-seeking element. Although your body contains hundreds of times more calcium than strontium, 99% of the strontium in your body is in your bones, where even this tiny amount of strontium produces huge beneficial effects on your bones. Strontium delivers a unique combination of bone health benefits that no other nutrient provides. It's the only mineral in our bones that both lowers the rate of bone resorption and promotes the rate at which new bone is built. And that's why strontium is one of the critical minerals that your bones need to stay healthy and strong. Confusion about strontium abounds, however, because this essential for bone mineral appears in three different forms and they have very different effects. The first form worth mentioning, and the most important one for your bones, is strontium citrate. Strontium citrate is a natural form of strontium in which the mineral strontium, which has a positive charge, like other minerals, is stabilized by being joined to citrate, which is an ion with a negative charge. You've probably seen other mineral supplements like magnesium citrate, in which citrate is combined with a mineral to produce a stable mineral compound. It's called a mineral salt. This is a bit of a misnomer because only the mineral sodium, when it is combined with the ion chloride or table salt, is actually salty. Or you may be familiar with citric acid, which is present in citrus fruits and is a combination of citrate with hydrogen instead of a mineral. Stabilizing strontium by combining it with citrate has several advantages. Citrate is alkalinizing. It helps the body maintain a more alkaline pH which cells require for healthy metabolism. Many enzymes do not work unless the pH inside the cell is slightly alkaline. Plus, citrate very quickly and easily breaks away from its mineral partner during digestion, releasing the mineral, in this case strontium, for absorption. For these reasons, strontium citrate is a natural, stable form of strontium that is easily digested, is well absorbed, and makes a beeline for your bones where it improves both bone density and quality which is bone's resistance to fracture, without side effects. This is the form used in Aldecal's Strontium Boost product. The second form worth mentioning is radioactive strontium, known as strontium-89. Yep, radioactive strontium. This form is given intravenously during chemotherapy to treat prostate and advanced bone cancer patients. You can't buy radioactive strontium. It's a highly controlled substance used only in chemotherapy by well-trained medical professionals. The third form of strontium is strontium ranolate. It's not available in the US or Canada either, and its use in Europe has been greatly restricted. Strontium ranolate is a man-made form of strontium in which the natural mineral strontium has been combined with a man-made compound called ranolaic acid. It's been used as a prescription drug in the European Union to treat low bone density, but its use, as I mentioned, has been greatly curtailed because the ranolic acid in this form is potentially toxic and is what causes the variety of side effects associated with strontium and unfairly gives natural strontium citrate a bad name. Let's start with the common not so dangerous side effects of strontium ranolate. Nausea, skin irritation, fainting, loose stools, and headaches. Then there's the more severe, potentially lethal side effects, venous thromboembolism, which is a scientific name for blood clot formation in the deep veins, serious autoimmune diseases like DRAS, which stands for drug, rash, eosinophilia, and systemic systems, as well as serious skin conditions like Stevens-Johnson syndrome, or SJS, and toxic epidermal necrolysis, or TEN. As you can see, strontium ranolate, the man-made prescription version, is extremely dangerous to the human body. In fact, its use has never been approved and continues to be banned in the US and Canada due to these side effects, and its use is very limited in the EU now in light of these findings. 
The natural strontium, strontium citrate, on the other hand, has no such side effects. In fact, it's clinically been proven to help increase bone density, especially when combined with a natural plant-based calcium supplement that also delivers vitamins D3, K2, magnesium and boron, and the full range of bone essential trace minerals, in other words, AlgaCal Plus. Make sure that you do not confuse natural strontium citrate with its toxic counterpart, strontium ranolate. And don't worry about taking strontium ranolate, you can't. It's banned in North America. I hope you see now that strontium is a natural element and when combined with citrate, can be instrumental in helping you to maintain and build your bone density. Please read below as I dive into the latest research on strontium. Don't let misinformation prevent you from getting all the truly amazing beneficial effects that natural stable strontium can deliver for your bone's health. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe so you never miss a video from AlgaCal. And if you want to see more unique videos on natural bone health, bone healthy and delicious recipes, bone building exercises, and so much more, check out some of our videos right here. And we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.